This section examines basic principles of light vehicle suspension systems. The suspension system isolates the body from road shocks and vibrations, which would otherwise be transferred to the passengers and load. It also must keep the tires in contact with the road. When a tire hits an obstruction, there is a reaction force. The size of this reaction force depends on the unsprung mass at each wheel assembly. The sprung mass is that part of the vehicle supported by the springs, such as the body, the frame, the engine, and associated parts. Unsprung mass includes the components that follow the road contours, such as wheels, tires, brake assemblies, and any part of the steering and suspension not supported by the springs. Vehicle ride and handling can be improved by keeping unsprung mass as low as possible. When large and heavy wheel assemblies encounter a bump or pothole, they experience a larger reaction force, sometimes large enough to make the tire lose contact with the road surface. Wheel and brake units that are small and light follow road contours without a large effect on the rest of the vehicle. At the same time, a suspension system must be strong enough to withstand loads imposed by vehicle mass during cornering, accelerating, braking, and uneven road surfaces.